small plane lost control north of San Diego, then plowed into the back of a car which had pulled over on the side of the road. This morning, one person is dead, several others seriously injured, and ABC's Lauren Lister has more for us from Los Angeles. Report of a plane down, an airplane down on the freeway. Four victims in this plane ride turned tragedy in the hospital this morning, battling their injuries. That small two-seater aircraft running into trouble at around 9 a.m. Saturday morning. You can hear them coming real slow, sputtering a little bit. Plowing into the back of a sedan on the side of this California highway. Dying in the wreck, 38-year-old Antoinette Isabel of San Diego, seen here competing with her roller derby league. Three other members riding with her in that car. The dramatic rescue caught on cell phone video. Bystanders and first responders smashing the windows. <laughs> Crying open the door. Motorists rushing to help. Me and two other people are trying to get the door of the, of the plane open to get the pilot out. The 60 year old man now facing life threatening injuries. His female passenger in surgery Saturday. This aircraft was a home built aircraft. It was built from a kit by somebody in their garage or, or at an airport. So these kinds of airplanes generally have a much worse safety record than, say, a corporate jet or an airliner would. Just before the collision that morning, that car's driver pulling over to connect his cell phone. They did everything right. They did it, pulled over and stopped. This never really happens. It's amazing that there weren't even more injuries. The three other people in the car were taken to the hospital with injuries. The driver posting on Facebook, he wishes that day could start over, saying he's just working to process it all. Meanwhile, we're still waiting to learn exactly what caused that plane's crash landing. Dan? More questions. Lauren, thank you.